sheath your swords. That's the advice being given to the two men laying claim to the emirship of Kano State. In the last few days, both men, the post Emir Adobayaru and the restored Muhammadu Senu, have recorded small victories in their claim to the throne. Our correspondent has more. One of the biggest drama series to grace our TV screens in recent years has been The Game of Thrones. Based on the epic fantasy novel by George R. R. Martin, it's about a group of nine families who all lay claim to the Iron Throne of the fictional kingdom of Westeros. As far-fetched as it seemed, it kept hundreds of millions of viewers glued to their TV screens for over eight seasons. And now, you could say another such drama, or Game of Thrones, is playing much closer to home, in the ancient city of Karno, where two men, actually cousins and in-laws, are both laying claim to the ancient stool of the Emir of Karno. It all began on May 23 this year, when the Kano State House of Assembly passed a law that effectively removed the sitting Emir Adobairo from office. In his place, Mohamedou Sanusi, who himself was deposed in 2019 for Bayero, was reinstalled. Confusing? Well, it gets even more. Both men are actually cousins from the same ruling family, while Sanusi is also married to Bayero's younger sister. Talk about keeping it all in the family. Last week, a court ruled in favor of Bayero, saying his removal was unconstitutional. But Sanusi supporters are asking why this is so different from what happened to their candidate five years ago. Onlookers are now seeing this as a fight to the finish. And for now, this particular game of throne is keeping Nigerians as transfixed as the TV series. <laughs> 